Hi, welcome. Thanks for joining me. On this episode of Build Your Own, we're going to build, price, and option a 2021 Maserati Ghibli Trofeo, as well as learn about the features and configurations. Before we do, however, I just want to remind you that if you find this build and price review helpful, informative, or entertaining, please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. The 2021 Maserati Ghibli is a mid-sized luxury sedan that aims to charm with style and a bit of Italian flair. You'd expect as much from Maserati, and indeed the Ghibli is a more distinctive choice compared to the typical luxury sedans from America, Europe, and Japan. With a twin turbocharged V6 or V8 engine under its shapely hood, the 2021 Maserati Ghibli is the Italian thoroughbred of the mid-sized luxury sedan marketplace. This hot-blooded four-door looks the part too, with its aggressive swept-back headlamps, bodacious body sides, and distinctive fender vents. Most models get the V6, which makes either 345 or 424 horsepower and can be had with rear or all-wheel drive. If you opt for the V8 power trofeo, then the Maserati will swap the V6 for a Ferrari-derived 580 horsepower twin-turbo V8. Like its siblings, the Quattroporte sedan and the Levante SUV, the Ghibli now comes in a racy Trofeo trim powered by a 580 horsepower twin turbo V8. Opting for the range topping Trofeo also adds a limited slip rear differential and a Corsa driving mode with launch control. All Ghibli models receive a new infotainment system for 2021, which includes a larger 10.1 inch touchscreen display, a voice activated virtual assistant, and an available wireless charging pad. Okay, let's jump into this build and price review of the 2021 Maserati Ghibli. We're going to do the range topping, the fastest one, the Trofeo. But real quick, before we get started, I just want to remind you to take a look at some of my other related build and price reviews. I've put links down in the description below. So yes, we are going to do the 580 horsepower Trofeo. Other vehicles that this Trofeo competes against that I've done build and price reviews of, well, I recently did a build and price review of the 2021 BMW M5. I did the base model M5. Nice vehicle. I've always liked the M5. Uh, I did the 2021 Audi RS7 Sportback. That's a hot honey of a car there. Uh, I did the 2020 Mercedes AMG E63 S sedan. Always an oldie but goodie. I'll say that much. Uh, I did the 2020 Porsche Panamera Turbo. My favorite. I love that, that vehicle a lot. But the RS7 is really, really sweet. Uh, in addition to that, for fun, another Maserati I just recently did like the other day. I did the 2022 Maserati MC20. That's the exotic supercar there. So, yeah, after you watch this video, make sure you watch a few of those videos as well. Okay, so before we actually jump over to the configurator and, and spec out our top-tier Ghibli Trofeo, Let's check out these other configurations. There's four trim levels. You got the base model Ghibli right here. Starts at 74,390. Uh, it makes it's got the V6. It makes 345 horsepower, 369 pound-feet of torque. Does have rear-wheel drive, but you can option it with all-wheel drive. We could actually check out the engine, but you know what? We're gonna check out the engine on the Trofeo. So you got the the, the Ghibli, and then you've got the Ghibli S. Okay, it makes 424 horsepower. 406 pound-feet of torque. It's just about five grand more at 79,390. All right, so really, if you're trying to just get into a Ghibli, a Ghibli S is a nice way to go. Uh, you got the Ghibli S, and then after that, you got the Ghibli SQ4. It also makes uh, 424 horsepower. It's standard with all-wheel drive. Probably get some other bits in there. We'll learn about that, I'm sure, as we go along. It's 81,890, so it's not that big of a jump over an S. Now, what is a big jump is the Trofeo. It's almost $110,000. It's $109,890. That's your, base, that's your uh, starting price. 580 horsepower, 203 miles an hour, 0 to 60 in 4 seconds. It's got rear-wheel drive. I'm not sure if we can option all-wheel drive or not. And it's got 538 pound-feet of torque. Here we can see a few more specs about the Ghibli Trofeo. Uh, like its uh, dimensions and weight, it's 195.7 inches long, it's 76 inches wide, it's about 57 and a half inches tall, the wheelbase is 118 inches, uh, tires, what do we got for tires? We're running 245 40 20s up front, and we're running 285 35 20s in the back, 
engine. We know about the engine. It's 3.8 liter V6, 580 horse. It makes 538 pound-feet of torque, and it makes that torque from 2,250 RPM all the way up to 5,250 RPM. Uh, and then for performance specs, 203 miles an hour, 0 to 60 in 4 seconds. Let's see if we can click this and listen to the engine. It sounds okay. Okay, so Maserati has a more specific page all about the Ghibli Trofeo. They call it the Art of Fast. Uh, so let's dig into this page a little bit, see what other information we can extract. Okay, so of course the Trofeo is the fastest Ghibli. Uh, they say it's got uh, 0 to 60 in 4 seconds. We know that. Let's see what this discover more. Uh, they're talking about it's got the Corsa mode with launch control. Uh, and so that gives you faster throttle response, quicker shifting, a more intense exhaust note. Uh, there's, uh, they say the Trofeo is built around the most potent V8 ever to be fitted in the Ghibli. And it's, you know, it's a Ferrari-derived engine that makes the 580 horsepower and top speed of 203 miles an hour. This car is serious. So let's find out about the design of the uh, Maserati Ghibli Trofeo, the 2021 uh, let's discover more here. And what are they going to tell us? They're going to say speed. So they're talking about the looks. It's got a race-inspired design. There's high-gloss carbon fiber on the front, the rear, and the side air intakes. Uh, it's got a sculpted Trofeo hood with air extractors. Um, so, yeah. So talking more about design, they're talking about how there's a Trofeo badge is on the iconic lateral air vents. There's a Seida, I'm probably pronouncing it wrong, I'm sure, a Seida logo that's on the C-pillar uh, that features a daring red lightning bolt. And then there's the Italian flag on the B-pillar, and we can see that right here. There's the Italian flag on the B-pillar. Here they're talking about even the design of the engine. Uh, it's got a carbon fiber uh, uh, engine cover like many high-performance sedans do. And then they're here, the, uh, the uh, valve cover gaskets, the cylinder heads, are actually painted red here. So here they're talking about the 21-inch uh, Trofeo-specific forged wheels with the dark finish and the Brembo brakes specific and the Ghibli Trofeo bodywork. So uh, this car is very special. It's bodywork, it's wheels, the brake package, everything, obviously, uh, with 580 horse, over 200 mile an hour top speed. Here's another shot of that engine, a little closer, a little bigger shot. Beautiful motor. Okay, let's talk about the uh, interior design of the Maserati Ghibli Trofeo specifically. Here they want to let us know that despite it having a bunch of horsepower, a great V8 engine, that the Ghibli Trofeo interior delivers all the luxury, the technology, and the, connect and the connectivity that you expect of a prestigious sedan. Well, here they mention a carbon fiber sport steering wheel, but they show an all leather steering wheel. And they talk about sport foot pedals. And I can kind of see the sport foot pedals, and those look nice. Here they're talking about the carbon fiber and that there's many carbon fiber elements inside the cabin. Uh, and I love carbon fiber, so I'm all about carbon fiber. I think the leather seats look great. I love the stitching and the, uh, on the, the design of the seats and the contrast stitching. I think we're definitely going to have to do it in black leather. It looks great. Here they're just talking about the natural leather sports seats that have the Trofeo logo embossed on the headrests and how that illustrates the philosophy or something like that. So it says here that we can discover some distinctive features of the Ghibli. So we've learned some specific features of the Trofeo, but I want to learn about some specific features of the Ghibli in general. Here they're talking about safety and ADAS. Let's click on that. What does that tell us? Uh, they say the Ghibli can be equipped with a comprehensive range of level 2 advanced driving assist systems, which means even greater peace of mind. So what does that mean? It says discover more. Let's do that real quick. Okay, so they're Advanced Driver Assist Systems, ADAS, right? Uh, what does that really in uh, include? Adaptive Cruise Control with Stop and Go, Lane Keeping Assist, Surround View Camera, Highway Assist System, Active Blind Spot Assist, Traffic Sign Recognition, Four Collision Warning Plus, 
hill descent control. Okay, so that was the safety. Uh, under engines, that's probably going to be pretty self-explanatory. Yeah, here they're talking about there. there's two 3-liter V6 engines, uh, and then there's a V8 engine. We already know about the V8 engine, <clears throat> and we already know about the two V6 engines uh, that come in either 345 horsepower or 424 horsepower. Here they're talking about the full LED adaptive matrix headlamps. Uh, it's got 15 LEDs operating at full beam. Uh, very, very nice. Though I love uh, LED. I love light design on automobiles just in general. Oh, we can do a 360 navigation. Look at that. We can do a 360 navigation, and that's pretty cool. And does it give us different things to check out as we go around the points? No, it doesn't. Uh, but, yeah. Let's also take a look at the interior really fast. Okay, so here's the interior. Can we move around the interior? Yep, we can move around the interior. We can click a bunch of things, a bunch of stuff around the interior. Looks like there's going to be a couple different sound systems, a Bauer and Wilkins sound system, a Harman and Kardon sound system. Uh, just the regular seats on, a tro on the Ghibli look nice, don't, don't they? Yeah, folding rear seats here they're talking about. All that looks great, looks fantastic, love all the contrast stitching, love the wood on the door. Uh, here they're talking more about sound system. What are they going to tell us about the sound system? Uh, yeah, two unparalleled sound systems. You've got the Harman Kardon and the Bowers and Wilkins, so they're just getting redundant with that. Uh, you got the ZF 8-speed automatic transmission, wireless charging. Here's your Maserati Connect. That's your infotainment system. It gives you Amazon Alexa. Uh, hopefully there's Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. I don't even see anything about that. But I would love to think that for that price point at $75,000, yeah. You've got the Maserati Intelligent Assist uh, down here. And you've got uh, a highway assist system. You've got a multifunction steering wheel. You've got driving modes. Uh, we know the Trofeo has its, oh, it has its own specific driving modes. All right, so let's move on. All right, we're about ready to do the build, but let's check out what accessories we can get for the Ghibli first. So here they got a sport accessories. Look at all the carbon fiber you can get. That's awesome. So there's a exterior carbon fiber package. Uh, they've got more wheels. They got wheel options. You got uh, care and protection packages like all weather floor mats, stuff like that. Transport and loading solutions, technology and functionality like pad holders and stuff like that safety all good stuff very cool stuff nice accessories beautiful car love the carbon fiber let's go do the build okay here we are on the configurator first thing we need to do is check the colors non-metallic colors here we've got bianco white we've got nero black can we get a different look that's a better look there we've got metallic colors we've got black We've got Grigio, which is a gray, I believe. Yeah. And then we have another Grigio. So we have Grigio Mar Mar Maritia or something. And then a regular Grigio. We've got this blue, which isn't bad, but we're not going to do that. And then we've got this, this white, but it's like a pearly white. And that is the way to go. We're going to go ahead and do that pearly white. With the wheels here, what do we have? 21-inch silver forged wheels. The rest of them are black wheels, black wheels, black wheels, black wheels. And so if you, you're either going to do black wheels or you're going to do these. I want to do the silver forge wheels because I just don't want to do black wheels. Uh, I wish we could get the air vents not in red, but whatever. It's fine. Uh, moving on, the brake calipers. We're going to go ahead and keep those brake calipers in red. I, they might as well match the, the vents and everything like that. So, yeah, let's move on to uh, interior. Moving on to interior, we've got the, right now what's selected is extended leather with contrast stitching. I like that. What's this one? That's black. What's this? This is just other colors. What's these colors here? I don't even know. It's getting very complicated all of a sudden. Um, I just wanted the what we had before. Well, at any rate, I can't get back to whatever seats we were at. I don't even know how I got over here. I can't pronounce this name on the style of the seat, meaning the texture or whatever. But I know we have red leather. It's extended leather. I can see that kind of here. Uh, we can do something with the dashboard. Okay, we got the red leather dashboard, the carpet. 
black carpet, steering wheel, it's a full leather steering wheel, headliner, I guess you got two things with the headliner, black or grigio, we'll leave it in black, trim, we've got carbon, high gloss carbon fiber, or you can do the high gloss piano, we've got the high gloss carbon fiber, that certainly works, uh, what else is there, now there's packages, here's the interior carbon fiber package, carbon fiber column mounted paddle shifters and door sills, okay, check, uh, the climate package, heated windshield washer, heated rear seats, power rear sun blind. Well, I know I want that sun blind, and so I guess, there. oh, we already have that package, done, sold. All right, options here. So neither the Harman Kardon nor the Bowers and Wilkins, well, the Harman Kardon is standard. You can, you can up the ante with the Bowers and Wilkins for $2,100, done, done. Uh, extended leather with contrast stitching, we have that. Heated steering wheel, have that. Sport pedals, we have that. They say show more options. Fine. What else do you have? Power adjustable foot pedals. 12-way uh, power sport seats, we have that. Uh, you can get a rear armrest with illuminated storage. Okay. Uh, we've got the uh, Zegna leather upholstery, I think. I don't even know what kind of upholstery we have. I can't even pronounce the words. Uh, front and rear parking sensors. We don't get that for $114,000. We can't get a parking sensor. All right, let's. I guess we better get it. I, I, is it a no-cost option? I'm not even sure. Here's all-season tires, rear laminated glass. We do have the adaptive LED matrix headlamps. I don't know what the nearest. I don't know what this package. What is that package all about? Oh, that's a blackout. If you want to like make all the chromey stuff dark. Uh, BMW calls it shadow line, for instance. Uh, no, we don't want to do any of that. So let's just go to the summary. And here we are. Uh, the 2021 Maserati Ghibli Trofeo, fully loaded out, 114690 out the door. Uh, nice car, though. If some, nice alternative if you want something different than German sedans, even though they're really cool. Maybe you want something different. This is certainly that. And it's going to deliver a lot of performance, but you don't have the all-wheel drive like the German sedans do. They're all they're all sporting all-wheel drive these days. But at any rate, I like this car a lot. I, I'm I, I'm liking the Maseratis just in general. I'm going to do the Quattroporte soon, so make sure if you're not already subscribed, you subscribe to the channel so you don't miss that build. Uh, on that note, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this build up. Uh, so if you found this review of the 2021 Maserati Ghibli Trofeo, helpful, informative, or entertaining, please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Other than that, I'm going to tell you to have a wonderful day, and I will see you on the very next video.